Hello, what it all, this is Luckless Love Locks, and I'm about to do some of my favorite things in the world. Explore a gorgeous, mysterious place, solve puzzles, and share my experiences with all of you. So sit back, relax, let's go on this adventure together. Or you can get really upset that I can't figure out the solutions to the puzzles and yell at the screen. We're gonna play Cocoon together as a, uh, a light comes from the sky, which causes us to, to hatch from the cocoon. And we're some kind of bug person. Uh, I am playing this totally blind. So if you have seen this before, please do not spoil. Um, let me try to figure stuff out on my own. Let's have some fun. I could go down those stairs, I guess, over there. But there's some more. But what's over here? Bird. There's a ball down there and a path with some symbols. Can I... Jump? Fly? All I can do is walk right now. Okay. Still getting over being sick, so there might be some little uh, interruptions. You know, being sick really, really sucks, but it also really makes you appreciate when you're healthy. Can't fall. It's given me some, uh, I'd say like some Tunic vibes, which is a game I really enjoyed that I played on the channel. All right, well, guess we're not going back up there. What's this? Huh. That rock is a little weird, eh? It's got like a a fin on it. Okay, let's leading us down to here. There's little bubbles from the control switch. Yeah, Tunic was a really special experience. I'm hoping this will this will be kind of similar. Little bugs? Or little little rats? Little animals? Another control pad with more of those bubbles, kind of circuitry stuff. I'm just hitting A on there to activate them. Oh, and this is what we saw from above. I'm assuming I could push this? Oh, I could pick it up, oh, but it's stuck. Oh, okay. Drops it. Another panel. Almost looks like a creature. It is. That's that's what you do. That's your whole purpose. You just chill there until a bug person shows up. I'm not gonna question it. You know, we all have our purpose in life. Although it's probably just, it's probably machinery rather than something that's actually alive. Ooh. Floaty things. Flying things. Can I do anything else on these switches? No. Can I activate you and then move? Or... Oh, I see that there's some bubbles here. I 
I connect you? Also, oh, there we go. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. First puzzle solved. Surely I could fly, right? Like this looks like, maybe we learn how to do it. Like we metamor metamorphosize. Oh, I have to hold the button down. Ah. Transform, the uh, evolve. Okay, that seems just based on the music and what it looks like. That looks kind of evil compared to the other stuff you've seen. Uh-oh. Fence? Yeah. Saw that coming. As you can see, I like to go the wrong way first in games. Oh. That's freaking cool. Yes. Oh, hi, friend. Uh, not friend? Oh, they went. They went in there. I can care. What? Oh, these are like different worlds, probably, right? I think that's what the game is like. You can... It's like these marbles that hold different worlds. And you can go in and out of them. To, to, to progress. Don't know how that's all going to work, but... Uh, or we use them to power stuff? Is that... Yeah, okay, okay. Can I do anything else with it? If I pick it up. Sure you can't just fly over? Is there going to be lots of secrets in this game? Yeah, I got you. teaching us that it powers things. Okay. I think I, I kind of knew that from some of the lead up. Like, I think I saw some trailers for this game. There's that symbol again that we saw by the other sphere. I keep wanting, I keep, I keep thinking like, that kind of looks like it could be a secret. Ah, this probably powers the door, right? Yeah. If I put this down. Hold on. Oh, this is going to get complicated. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So I need to... Pardon me. Drop it in here. Hit this. Hit this. Then run down to hit that. But what's gonna happen? Oh, and then that will create a platform, I guess? So we can get across. Can 
I go faster? I don't need to go faster. Oh, I was like, but how do I get over there? Bridge right here, buddy. I can cross here. No secrets. So, so far, it's only been one button. It's the whole game one button? I'm down for that. Timing based. My controller ran into batteries. <laughs> That's why there is a jump in the video. I don't think it goes far enough. Oh, I know what I need to do. This probably moves the back one, right? I gotcha. course. Can't go around there. There's an area above us, too. We're probably going to make it around there in a little bit. This feels very industrial compared to where we just came from. Holding, holding the button too. Other interaction. Hold on, what does this do? Okay, what does this do? Oh, uh, there we go. We can go in. Okay, there we go. We can go into the world. Now, this is the world that that other thing went into. But I can't leave. Do the worlds interact with each other? Do I have to do something in that world to lower those? They're like yellow, eh? That fence. So... It's the only power source we have, so... Gotta keep using it. Oh, that's cool. But I have... Okay. There's a wall there, too. This doesn't seem good. Another marble? Oh. Oh, you see the symbols, guys? It's just there's symbols on the tower. Is that the order that I have to hit them in? I have a notepad here. Perfect. Okay. It's like a triangle. And the circle. Pentagon, right?
like wings. That's four. It's like a diamond. I don't know what order they're supposed to go in. But we'll try. We'll try. Uh, diamond wings. Uh, pentagon. Circle. Triangle. There we go. Okay. I better move out of the way because that's going to pop in, right? And that's how a new world is created, everybody. Oh. No, that's how babies are born. <laughs> I really did not expect that, of all things. What does this do? Oh, you open the barriers. This is my boy, Carl, everybody. Say hi to Carl. Uh, all right, yeah, this makes sense. Oh, wrong spot. It's supposed to go here. Now we can open that fence. Excellent. I wonder if there's going to be any dialogue in this game. Probably not. Or can you open this too? Yes. Oh. Is that it? We lost Carl? Our short-lived friend, Carl. I don't know, would you guys go in there? I think I just live my happiest life. Okay, this is pretty cool. I would have regretted not going in, coming in here. Really, I'm so curious to know if there's any secrets. You know me, I like to find all the secrets. Little, little doors here, no? Path that goes this way. Hi, hi there. Stay, you stay put. Okay, so I could probably... I don't see any reason to stand on top of you. I think I drag you over and you act like a bridge? Oh, such delightful design. I wonder if I bring you further. What would be the point of bringing you all the way over here? Let's see. Let's see if anything happens. You probably won't walk past that, though, right? Yeah, okay. The path keeps going. I think we're going to jump over. Cool. Huh. Can't go back down. Let's not go that way first. Oh, Jesus! Ah! <laughs> I was wondering, they look they looked like there was there's some electricity between the crystals. Look at that thing down there. Uh, I was wondering what, what they were gonna do. 
I don't like you. Okay, I like it better down here. I don't know, this is pretty creepy too. It still seems happier. Oh, you're gonna give me uh, a marble? Nope. Was that the was that the thing that came into this world? That we saw before? Might have been. It was a different angle, so kind of hard to tell. But I think we had to do that. I also, I don't think there's combat in this game. I hope there isn't, because there's so many games with fighting. It's actually, I really... Hi there. I really appreciate a game that can uh, create a compelling experience without combat. This looks like combat. Hi. I think there's combat, guys. <laughs> okay. Okay, so we're just dodging. Still only one button so far. And the, obviously, analog, analog stick to dodge. Yeah, I hit A to get rid of those. So I have to... Oh, all right, all right. So if you run into it, you disarm, disarm the bomb. Looks like it doesn't hurt us. Is that the thing that we ran into in the other world, guys? Okay, this is kind of neat combat, though. This is, this is still different. It's always three, right? Yeah. Yeah, victory achieved! I, lo I love how I'm like, it'd be cool if this game doesn't have any combat, and then there's some combat, but it's different, you know? You're not shooting guns. What a, and the one thing I'm really enjoying about this is it's such a bizarre world. There we go. Oh! Oh! Oh, okay. We're infusing it with this power that changes the world that we're in. That's really cool. Where's this go? I, just, I can't put this down anywhere. Ah, uh, we need to see. Ah, there we go. It opened up. Yeah. 
Ja. Äh. We're changing the direction. So now if I bring this back. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So I want to actually, I want it to be... Like that. And then I can go back. Also, what's that thing in the middle looking at? This one's not activated. I love these little, like, bizarre machine creature things. Looks like a, a drill? Oh, it's a longer distance from the other side. I have time to run over and catch it. And it lost its power. Huh. No, it didn't. Just nothing for it to interact with, I guess. Anything up here? No. What's this do? Well, I, I want to... I want to put it into these slots first. I think I need two though, right? Yeah. That's the top ring, bottom ring. So I did the right thing. These machines are pretty cleverly designed, like when you move, you can't, you can't grab the orb. It like closes around it. Not like the other um, elevator things where, or pla moving platforms where you could stop the mid, mid movement. So it'll need to do a little sniff in there. Oh, this is one of those drill heads. Sorry, I shouldn't be calling you that. It's probably what everyone calls you, right? Oh. Oh, maybe I can get little drill head to come over here. Yeah. How about, uh, Bill? I stand on... Oh, you, oh, you. You go back to that spot, eh? So if I, if I drag you over here, I'll slowly move back there. And if I drag you onto the spot, you'll eventually both be standing on it. Right? Then I need to stand on you. Perfect. So, I'm noticing these two symbols. I bet you this is some kind of language that we could decipher, like, uh, like in Tunic, right? I've noticed these double triangles before, but they might have been in different, a different configuration. Ah. Here's another creature. 
Yeah, so these are the boss, the bosses, I guess, of the different worlds. Yeah. <laughs> Try to get out of the way, like. Thank you. So then we bring this back and we can activate. This. Joel, I guess, let us go into it. I don't know if the positioning matters. Oh, wait, 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 wait. So, okay. Does this do anything with this? I still have to go back and get the other one, right? Can I put it in here? Oh, I can hold on to it. What am I talking about? I don't know, that looks like it matches that color more. We'll see if the order matters. Oh, right. This is just like a teleporter... ...pod thing. So we can choose which one to teleport to. A new world! A wet world. The other one was a desert. Very arid, desert, dry world. Wait, arid is just another word for dry, right? Okay. Oh, you know what I need to do? Can I grab this and go into there? Yeah. I saw that there was a platform that needed powering, and I was like, how am I going to power that? That's how we're going to do it. Hi, friends. No, we can be friends. You don't need to do that. You don't. No, you really don't have to. Oh, I need Carl back. Go back here. Where, where did I use Carl? Huh. Oh, maybe. Okay, well, let's. I grab oh it replaces it okay good okay maybe I missed something
No? That's the orange crystals, right? I can go back. Can't go back. Can't go back to here either. Hmm. What is with that thing? Huh. Oh, right. Okay, I can go back here. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Oh! Oh, okay, okay, okay. We found the way forward. After being a little lost. That's, that's alright, it happens. Uh, we need... We need to find these symbols keep our eyes peeled. Oh, there we go. They're in the background. Uh, what's, what's, uh, six sides? A sixagon. Triangle. And to get all, almost think of it like numbers, right? Four, five, three, six, one, I guess. But I'm uh, making little drawings. Um, four. Triangle, Sixagon, oh yeah, this is, this is the this thing that gives us a little Carl, okay, 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 I didn't realize there was another way to go, Checking over there. It doesn't seem so far like there's a lot of secret paths. But maybe I'm just missing things. Wait, 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 wait. Will you make a path to this prism? No, there's something else we need. Get to that portal. Okay, back back on the run. And you open the door to the boss too. This is where we, we scare them? Yeah, there they are. Yeah, I'm coming for you. I don't know why, but I'm coming for you. You can't, you can't hide from me. I don't know why I'm doing this, but... 
is he like this looks like a secret if it's happening I don't know why I'm doing it but I'm doing it you guess this is as good as mine guys you have a can you think of a story reason why we're doing this hey hey that's not fair Oh, do I need to put this down? Is this what's hitting it? Uh, so I need to... Resurrect Carl. To get past the goo trap. You just have to do that. That's Carl's way of saying thank you. Carl 2.0. I guess we're going to have more of those coming up. Oh, or maybe not. Oh, God. Oh. Cool. Very cool. There you go. There you go. Get in there, buddy. Let me see already. They look trapped. That seems like it could be right. I don't got gotcha. you. Oh, oh, there's a thing here. Yeah, I was like, you can squeeze through. <laughs> Not with the marble. I think I need... I need some other kind of. I need a different marble. Okay, it's not like we're moving to a different spot in the world, right? already checked down here. Yeah. Okay. I must have missed something.
Uh, I thought maybe there'd be a bridge there. Maybe this way? The sounds, the sound changes. That was just a coincidence, I think. Okay, so I could drop that there. Oh, oh, so I need to drop that there so I can move to this side. Duh. Okay. I don't see how coming back is going to help me. And I need that to get through here. Oh, I, I think I get it. Am I changing like which? See how that one's brightened up and this one isn't? I wonder if I'm changing where I'm going to teleport to. But still, how is that going to help me? Oh, and it shows you the orange ones inside. Yeah. Can I put this? Hmm. Put this down. the first really tricky part. What if I... Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. I don't need to be carrying this. Oh, man. That's brilliant. I love how the game's teaching you. Like, there's no text or anything, right? It's just teaching you what you could do using the environment. It's not easy, guys. What kind of design is uh, to be praised? There's another barrier. And... Not going to be able to... I have to go the other way. I don't think there's anything I can do here. I just couldn't quite like see in my head like, okay, how am I going to get this through? But I, I knew it had something to do with like moving the the marble through the worlds using the teleporter. That's gonna unlock this. Thanks. There's something satisfying about pulling on balls that are like attached by a string. They had those in uh, that little big planet game, Sackboy game. It was fun. Ooh, that's scary. Cool. 
Okay, it's gonna start to get real tough now. They've taught us a bunch of stuff, right? Oh, this is the this is the boss fight. Okay, let's see what we got. Let's see what you got. Starfish. It's gonna spin around at us, right? Oh, does it last? The water beast. Ah, okay. Let's just stay away. Let's stay far away. You gonna shoot some water at me? Oh, there, there's the thing. I have to get you to break it? Oh no! What happens? You get tossed out of the world. Love it. I love that. So you don't die or anything. They just, they're just they like, get out of here! Okay. Don't run into it. Lesson learned. Do I have to wait for it to stop moving? See, these are basically like like just uh, dexterity based puzzles rather than like a real fight. Get it to open up. Oh, I don't know if sure if I hit it there. I don't think I got it to open up entirely. Okay, well, it looks like it's a different phase. Oh, and I think it's showing you... You have to use the light to see. See, this one's the one that we need to open up. They don't all have a uh, bulb inside of it. Oh, you're sucking, you're sucking. Sucking's my job. Shit, got me. And I guess, does that reset the whole fight? Looks like it. Oh, no, you can see it. You can see it. This one's glowing. You gotta give it some space, though. And I have to avoid it. Like shots. And okay, okay, okay. That's a hit. There it is, this one here. It's a bit hard to dodge though. With that with this type of angle. Isometric angle. One okay. Ooh. And there's a time limit, because you can see it's the ball start, starts to blink. Uh oh. <laughs> There's a. I knew it was going to spin around. 
Oh, it sucks too. Can I get through? Need to get closer to this. I think it's looking for me, right? Okay, good. Uh oh, this is gonna be tough. Bullet hell action. It's okay, I played Fury. Pretty good, pretty good at bullet hell stuff. I think we got it! Yes, we killed another thing and we're not really sure why. <laughs> because it's trying to kill us, I guess. <laughs> That's pretty satisfying. Thank you guys so much for joining me for this first episode of Cocoon. Let me know what you think in the comment section and please do like the video. I only ask on the first one because it helps to grow the channel. I'll see you on the next one and I love you all.